Welcome, dear listeners, to another captivating myth from ancient Greece. I'm Cleo, the muse of history and storytelling. Today, we delve into the extraordinary tale of Hephaestus, the god of fire and craftsmanship. Join me as we explore Hera's retribution and Hephaestus' remarkable journey of self-discovery. Hephaestus' birth held a unique origin in the realm of gods. Seeking retaliation against Zeus for Athena's birth, Hera bore Hephaestus without a father's involvement. However, unlike the other divine offspring known for their beauty, Hephaestus emerged with physical deformities, a stark contrast to the idealized image of divinity. Overwhelmed by her disappointment, Hera rejected Hephaestus, callously casting him from Mount Olympus. The baby god endured a long fall until he found himself in the sea near the island of Lemnos. Hephaestus was fortunate to be rescued from the clutches of the sea by Euronome, an Oceanid, and Thetis, a Nereid. They brought him to Lemnos, where he grew up unaware of his true origins. On the island, Hephaestus honed his skills in jewelry making and became a master craftsman. His talent at the forge became renowned, attracting the attention of the gods themselves. Driven by a desire to uncover the truth about his birth, Hephaestus embarked on a quest to uncover his lineage. His search led him to the painful realization of Hera's cruel rejection in his infancy, fueling his anger and determination. Eventually summoned back to Mount Olympus, he ascended as the divine blacksmith, earning admiration and respect among his divine kin. Born from Hera's anguish and rejection, Hephaestus transformed into a figure of immense strength, resilience, and unmatched ingenuity. His journey of self-discovery allowed him to embrace his unique talents and become a force to be reckoned with. Join me next time as we uncover more enchanting tales from Greek mythology. Don't forget to follow for more exciting stories and myths. Until then, farewell, my friends.